what is up man your boys here now i promised to do this video this is the 48 minute long cyberpunk 2077 game play reveal baby that's what i'm talking about that's how you reveal the game right there you give everybody like almost an hour to check it out so we're gonna check this out uh, <laughs> I'm actually excited for Cyberpunk, but I mean, that's because you got some of them game studios that just don't really do you wrong. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't do no wrong to nobody. So I'm definitely interested to see what's going to happen to this. Uh, I will chop and cut because it is 48 minutes and I'm not going to be that interactive because I'll be trying to look for stuff and things like that but i will uh cut it down a little bit for you guys you know 48 minutes nigga, that's like it's a whole episode of a show god here yeah. she looks dope Welcome to the gameplay demo walkthrough of CD Projekt. Thing you see is potentially subject to change. Man, y'all better not change shit. Cyberpunk 2077. You can fully customize your character. We need to define our backstory. What oh. you choose here will unlock different possibilities later in the game. Okay. Also, you can use an array of different options to modify how you look. Set up. You'll notice we didn't pick a class. Cyberpunk 2077 features a fluid class system. And you'll be able to modify your class throughout the game. Oh, that's this dope. You ain't stuck. Place near the beginning of the game. You're not Being stuck. Your friend Jackie, along with a netrunner named Tiba, are hired to find and retrieve a missing person. A girl whose locator implant went dark. It's clear. Go. Target V. Room is too simple. Not our girl, I think. Keep looking. It looks like these scavengers are kidnapping people to harvest their implants. Oh, that's some sick shit. Okay, things are about to get heated. Ah! Oh, real okay, silence, baby. Underwater, Nick. Rarely allows us to use the Perezhnikov ability. Okay, so you got boosters. Shit. I see them hit numbers. This is Kereznikov. Oh, bullet time. Bullet time. Cover, cover. <laughs> he could bust it through the wall. Like, uh. That's dope. I like that. Damn. This does not look good. No, in a minute. The details dope, though. I mean, it's really dope. Sandra Dorset in C fifty seven oh four forty two. Got a mission unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims Bro, look at all that detail. Like the fucking cavalry. <laughs> look at all that shit. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected cost of your rest. Oh, she got paid right there, Nick. Fuck, I'm talking about. Yeah, she's flatlining. 
that you need to know what's going on. Jackie, air hypo! Stand clear. Landing. Stop where you are! Click the patient on the stretcher. Nigga, y'all aggressive? I just saved her life. I said step back. AC-133 to control. Patient NC-570-442 secured. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 805. Hey, give us a lift out of here. Nope. No Fuck you. T-bug out. Clear. That was trauma. A kind of high-end premium medical insurance. Don't have much time for what Buck said. We've delivered the target, and Tiba has notified us that the scavengers have called in reinforcements. Let's get out of here before they arrive. They got the eddies for new wheels now. I had something real fine too. Okay. We'll take these trusty pistols. Also grab our jacket. I don't say like you. That's the only weapon you got, bro. Cyberpunk 2077 is an RPG. The jacket not only provides us with protective stats like armor, but it also increases our street cred. Street cred is a form of experience the player acquires by completing side missions. It is used to unlock new vendors and content throughout Night City. All right, let's go meet Jack. V's current apartment is located inside a mega building. A huge building complex that forms a micro society of its own. In this timeline, technology and the world have evolved in some ways that seem familiar, but entirely surprising in others. As an example, in this world, people pay with eddies, slang for euro dollars. We make sure to root every detail in the world's lore so everything has its purpose and stays believable. Bro, let me get five eddies, cuz. A big part of our RPG experience is having a world that is interactive. Here, a generic ad has morphed into an advertisement specifically tailored to me, informing her of the nearest vendor she can purchase the product. In this case, it shows us where to find some Nicola soda. Hmm. Boxing robots getting that ass beat. Hopefully they lighten the world up because uh, according to this, they, I didn't even see that can roll out. Shit. This is Wilson, one of Night City's many guns and oppression are the norm. Hmm. We are working hard to make Night City fully realized seamless open world with no loading screen. That'd be dope. Currently, we're in Watson, a former industrial district where crime now mixes with money. The city streets are bustling with crowds of people from all facets of life, all living their lives within a full day and night cycle. I like that night cycle shit. I've always liked that in games. Nah, I've been asking more questions than that. It turns out we've caught the attention of one of Night City's biggest players. Let's roll. Nigga, I ain't say you can drive with me. Got any questions for me? We're on it all, I think. 
time I got to work. Beautiful. Beautiful. I ain't taking no job that easy, nigga. I'm going to be like, I'm going to ask a bunch of questions. Yeah. See you at the after lunch soon as the job's done. Do good, and this will be the start of a beautiful friendship based on heaps of evidence. Nigga, did you take me it back to where Dexter I was? has given us a test of sorts to see if we're worried. He wants us to retrieve a piece of high-tech combat gear a local gang stole from the Militech Mega. We'll be able to approach this job from a variety of angles. Let's try calling the Militech contact to see where that leads. It's out here. Hi. Um... Heard you were looking for some tech. Let's talk. Hey, everybody, shut it! Where is it? Come on, spell. On the horn? No. Amateur hour, Jesus. First exit off Skyline going towards the NID. Storm channel under the overpass. Meet you there. The situation's tricky because the contract giver is a corporate agent who seems a little high strung. Before we get down to business, it's a great idea to visit our Ripper dump. Sound like a drug to me, nigga. Cops is gonna let you sell Time that shit? is a common occurrence. Night City is not a safe place. Life here is not easy. Is that a hologram of what happened? <laughs> nigga got shot down for tagging. I hope I never see that future. Niggas is sticking shit in they fucking. <sighs> We're at a Ripper Doc clinic. Ripper Docs are specialist vendors who offer people the possibility to install. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later. With interest. You know I will. Last time, I swear. Now sit. Oh, no, no, no. I need to do a half ass job. You ain't got the money up front. Your ass gonna be in the middle of a mission, glitching out and shit, getting shot up. That's Karoshi. Best I've got. It should be about right under the circumstances. See that? The best I got. And should be about right. Hell no. Nah. I want somebody else. Carve away. Okay, all clean. Now for the fun stuff. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now Hopefully there's the other rip doctors around. Feel anything? Doc. Play by play. Makes you sound like a dentist. You're always going on and on. Is that her head? Oh, nigga, that was her head. So, how's it look to you? With the scanner, we can zoom in on things and take a closer look. This Hope I'm dead. Beautiful. Time for the scan. Additionally, we can analyze objects, get details on enemy weak points or gang affiliation. It might take you a while to adjust. Those times we really charm than anything, really. Scanner should have been. Thanks again. You're the best, Vic. He pulled her head off. Go on, kid. Show him what you can do. And once you hit the big time. I want a new rib doctor. Nigga seems sideways. Some docs operate legally. Others provide black market services. There we go. For the right price. They can even offer to install illegal military grade cyberware. So I'm going to need a legal nigga and one of them, uh, you know, side niggas. A few minutes ago, said he'd wait outside. Mm -hmm. 
Night City never sleeps. Danger lurks around every corner, even in daytime. Random encounters like these are an example of how your actions directly influence your open world experience. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, Jackie. So, they're done riding our asses? Scabs? Sure, maybe. Could be looking for a new spot to slice and dice, not coming after us. Knows. Real messed up in there for scars. Saw it yourself. I like that view a lot better. Many forces are fighting for control of Night City, but the mega corporations are the real showroom. The agent we're going to meet represents Militech, one of the largest companies in the private military sector. Where are we stopping? Remember the corpo off Dex's shard? Ringer, she's in the area, love me. Let me guess. She's in hot court for water. Desperate. When you think you can use that. See if I can, yeah. You sure you still want to meet him? Don't know enough. Yeah, gotta do this. Don't you move a damn muscle. Not unless I start, that is. Out. Take it you were the one to call? Yep. Want it? Because you're smart? That you could blackmail me, sick? Set positions? Calm the hell down. What is I this? I got you now, asshole. You're insane. Who the fuck is this? I'll know in two seconds flat. That fucking thing ready? All set. Are you here alone? The Corpos have hacked us through our personal link and have subjected us to a kind of lie detector program. The dialogue system in Cyberpunk 2077 is fully gameplay. Look at the nigga eyes, this shit's dope! You came alone! Yep, just little old me. She's lying. Search the area. Now listen, boys, we don't need to be here all day. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilbert. Did he or another asshole at Militech leak info to you or anyone else about a convoy? It might be tempting to reach for the gun, but the mm -hmm. consequences could Got be dire. To do with him Remember, or these guys are really tough. Shit. Checks out. <laughs> you got nothing on me. Nothing. Won't get away with this, you bitch. You're dead. Somebody shut him up. Take me home. Now. See, I would have went to the gun and probably be dead. I have no idea who you're working for or what you even want. But you better give me something solid or I will end you. I've got an offer. Oh, you are stretching. In any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. See, I would have went for the gun. This cunt's good as dead. The agent gave us the money to buy the bot we need from the gang by choosing to call the Militech agent early. We have now opened up a non-violent path through this quest. Of course, we could try and keep the money, but that would mean we'd have to take the merchandise by force, which requires a lot of firepower. Ah, I like that shit. Okay. Looks a little fishy, you know. A couple tents. No signal, so I stay put. Good thing, too. Went down about like I expected. Made a deal, and we're good to meet with Maelstrom now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So now you can go in and buy that bitch. You ain't gonna go in there shooting it up, doing no big long mission. You just go in, and buy it, let them get their mole. But will that have consequences, though, is the real question. Hmm? Be there soon. What do you expect? Corpse don't forgive or forget. Even these bored fucks sense that. This demo, let's try the more diplomatic approach. Good, good. So that's what I would do. All we need for them to buy it. Want to talk to Royce? The five nine. I'm waiting. Oh shit! This abandoned all foods meat factory, their hideout. 
charming. For another one. Nigga, it's dark as fuck. Maybe we should have taken him by surprise. A little late for regrets like that. Got us in their sights now. Just keep moving. <laughs> Cool. They're just trying to spook us. Remember, we've chosen to buy the tech, not steal it. Hopefully, this will go yeah, fast and easy. This is a pretty well guarded place. You can imagine what would have happened if we'd taken the violent path. I would have killed everybody, nigga. I would have been in that mug. Looking to buy a bot. Model MTOD-12. Looks like a spider. Better. Oh, these niggas some druggies, too. How the fuck you get machine yeah, druggies? The bot. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Tricked out, state of the art, this thing. Don't even got no standard port. Bells and whistles, though. Dynamic camo arm. Two questions. What the fuck's going on? And who the fuck is this? Got 50 large in this prison. And you positively reek of Militech. Dexter Deshaun sent me. Dexter Deshaun. Dreads. Gold plate. Fat old fuck. Got him? <laughs> we'll pay for the bot. Be on our way. How much you say you had? 50k? Dreads. Before we figure out a way to leave, let's grab the splinter that controls the bot from one of these dead maelstrom. I was gonna say, nigga, don't you still need to get the bot? Now I know if they put this mission the in the game. System allows us to I ain't doing it this way. At the splinter. You can inspect specific items to reveal details that can help in solving quests. I'm just gonna go in. Give me this bot, bitch. Give me this bot, bitch. Give me this bot, bitch. Okay. Or chip wears. With this done, the body will now follow us wherever we go. All right, what else do we have here? So, at this point on, we're going to unlock the abilities of a high-end character to showcase some of the different mechanics we have. In oh man, that means y'all are gonna be super. Weapon modules we now have installed is a ricochet targeting system connected to our eyes. This allows players to bounce bullets off walls and hit enemies hiding behind cover. Oh yeah, buddy. Yes, sir. I'm be using that. Straight warning the niggas. Eh, eh, eh. He didn't move though. This is another targeting system that will reveal enemies behind walls. Paired with the penetrating rounds of our tech shotgun, it's a deadly combination. Looks like we found some loot. This is a smart one. It's mm. one of the more advanced weapons in the game. Allowing bullets to track and follow their targets. It's See y'all showing us all this dope shit. Can acquire. Weapons are built of modules that allow for deep customization and progression. This way, you can be sure to find something that will suit your place. The toughest bastards guarding this route. Probably some reason for that. <laughs> dope, nigga. Bullets going around corners and shit.
she stay taking them legs out. That must be the weak spot. Oh, shit. How he still say that after dying, after the head was gone? Just a reminder, everything you've seen and are about to see, including this particular feature we're about to show you, is from a work in progress version of the game that may change over the course of development. All that shit's covered. Okay, let's try something different. We're going to take this guy down and connect directly to his neural side. In the world of Cyberpunk, once you are jacked into a network, you have access to everything it connects to. Through this Maelstrom gang map, we've now connected to the gang hideout's internal network. Ah. This is the building's personnel system. Let's focus on the squad containing the Maelstrom ganger we just connected to. From here, we can deploy software that affects the whole squad. For now, we'll simply unlock the ability to perform quick hacks. All right, time to show off our new high-level abilities. With quick hack, using the back door we unlocked a minute ago, we'll install a virus that jams the connection between the Maelstrom Ganger and his weapon. This will prevent him from firing. <laughs> Looks like he's having a problem now. Nice. Some of you might recognize these mantis blades. We can also double jump and bounce off of walls which makes us a very agile, fast solo. Must be nice to be able to unlock all the skills. If this was brighter, I'd probably be able to enjoy it a little bit more, but on my screen, it's just dark as hell. Sweet, we just found a corporate tech rifle. Corpo weapons are top of the line. Y'all didn't find shit. You planted it there for this demo. Let's scan this guy and see what's going on. It looks like Royce is back. And he's prepped. He's got an armored exoskeleton. You won't be able to get rid of him that easily. Our weapons are not dealing a lot of damage because he's packing an autonomous shield. Luckily, the scan we performed earlier revealed a weak spot. Attacking should bring the shield down. Shields down. Let's finish him off. Okay, let's put him down and get this job over. That wasn't the smoothest raid, but we've got the bot, and Dex should be happy. But think back. What would have happened if we hadn't met with the Militech agent? or told Royce about the agent and her plans, or just decided to buy the bot ourselves. So many options, so many possibilities. Uh, uh, games like this need multiple playthroughs. The game world and your story. And that's just one quest. Let's head out and finish the job. About goddamn time. Let's get out of here. Hell's that man? You know, we really ought to work together more often. Your chip had the clap. That's not discreet. You set me up. 
I fucked you over, you fucked the gang over. Somewhere at the start of the story, somebody fucked the corp. See Show the point. Now? Only the corp gets what it wants. Remember that. Learn it. Raging bitch to whoever's doing my dirty work for me. It's time we were on our way, I know. Okay, let's it's call Dax and tell him area. how things went down. My girl, Kate. She eat eating how suits. about bed looking? Mama Nosh. Hey, Mr. Dex. Get us that table at the afterlife? Hmm, matter of fact, I did. Just in my gut and all, you know. Well, you were right to. Whatever, nigga lying. <laughs> well done. Believe it, Ina. Major leagues. We're in. <laughs> I mean, why the door open? Thought the only thing I'm gonna pry open right now is a bottle of scotch. Oh, no. You fucking alcoholic. Por favor. Need to get to know this city, Jack. Not just gun in hand. I'm on a crusade. Amen, Ina. We finished the job, but our story is just beginning. This concludes our gameplay demo walk. Thanks for watching. Game's gonna be dope. But it's gonna be one of them ones where you gonna be you gonna need multiple saves because you're gonna wanna try different methods. I've always liked playing games where I could be like stealthy or diplomatic and shit and just try to work my way through. You know what I'm saying? Be like, nigga, I ain't gotta fire no bullets, nigga. I can save my bullets, save my clips. But, you know, I feel like this game may force you into a couple firefights or a couple real tough situations. But like I said, you're gonna wanna try different. Man, City's Project Red, bro. They, they, they pouring everything into this mug like they should. And that's gonna make it a classic game. I bet you this game's gonna break so many modes, man. Put so many other game companies on blast. It's not much to say other than the fact that I'm I'm ready. Hold on, I leave my like on the video. My fault. Other than the fact that, nigga, I'm ready. Anyway, y'all leave y'all comments down below. What other game trailers y'all want to see me react to over here at A187 Gaming? You know what I'm saying? Leave your comments. What y'all want to see? What you want my thoughts on? Just let your boy know in the comment section. And get in the comment section, man. We talk. We'll talk to you. We will talk to you. All right? Your boy's Nixon. Come on now.